Folks, how is it going? Hope you're having a great day. So my father actually asked me to make a video on this to see what you guys think or if any of you out there have had this issue. To catch everyone up, my father owns a 2018 Toyota Tundra limited double cab 4x4. And he's having a weird little issue and it's reoccurring. It's happened over the last year pretty much. I think the first one was December 2018. But once again, to catch everyone up, here's a couple pictures of his truck and then we'll come back and talk about the issue. All right, so what you're seeing right now is the issue that he went in for on 12-13-2018. And it has to do with the tire pressure sensor and corrosion. All right, so here's the details, I'll read it to you. Tire pressure sensor upon vehicle inspection, technician found, tire pressure monitor sensor, fix kit corroded and leaking, and he replaced the fit kit. Okay, so that was 2018, or excuse me, um, December 2018. Now, if we move on down the road a little bit, we got another one from July 6th, 2019. And once again, it's the TPMS system concern. Customer say, excuse me, customer states the driver's side rear tire is leaking from sensor. Check and advise upon vehicle inspection, technician found. Fit kit corroded and leaking. Technician removed and replaced fit kit for the tire pressure sensor, left rear. So there you go, those are two right there. So today, he was actually in there again for the same issue. But here is the kicker. It's on three different tires. This hasn't been the same tire over and over and over again. It's just happening with all his tires. So I asked him to give me a brief summary of what exactly is going on, and this is what he wrote. Well, I see my low tire pressure light on, and I look at tire pressure on the dash, usually around 24 pounds. Yesterday, it was 27 pounds. I put soap on the offending tire valve, and if it bubbles, that's it. And they said at Toyota that it's corroding, so that makes three. So that's why he wanted to make me or wanted me to make a video for you guys to see what was going on. The first time it happened, I believe it was a rear tire, and he tows his boat and he backs it into the water. So maybe the tires got in the water a little bit, and that's what happened. Um, some people might say it's because you live close to the ocean and things rust really quick and corrode really quick around here, but I haven't had this issue. I've never actually heard of this issue on a Tundra. And that, my friends, is where you come in help my father out because he's really just throwing his hands up in the air at this. The truck's not old. It has like 10,000 miles on it. He got it in January 2018, I believe. So under two years old, 10 to 12,000 miles on it. And this is his third time he's had to deal with this. So he joked at the end of it and said, I'm just waiting for the fourth at this point. Takes it into Toyota. Um, they replace it under warranty right away. It's not an issue, but still, what do you got for me? Twitter and Instagram at tundra 34 tundra 34 at gmail.com. Have you ever heard of this? Do you have this issue on your Tundra? And if so, if you have a solution, help the man out other than just going back to Toyota each time and replacing it. But have a good day, and I look forward to hearing from you.